Hi guys, I'm Dr. Rajat. Now, can root canals cause sinus infection? If you have recently had a root canal and you are starting to feel the symptoms of sinus infection or the sinusitis, you may be wondering if these things are related. Now, is it possible for a root canal to cause sinus infection? Now, the answer is no. But there are few catches and complexities when it comes to this. Infected teeth, not root canals, cause sinus infections. As mentioned, root canals are not the cause of sinus infection. So why would you get a sinus infection after you get a root canal therapy? Well, the chances are that if this happens to you, it is not because of a root canal, but due to the tooth infection that has required you to get treatment with a root canal, root canal doesn't cause sinusitis but tooth infections do why it comes down to the anatomy of tooth your upper teeth and the upper molars in particular have deep roots that reach into your jawbone and they actually are located very close to the sinus lining so uh, if your tooth becomes infected and the roots of the teeth are full of bacteria now this bacteria can easily spread through the roots into the maxillary sinus which are located right above the teeth now this in turn cause a sinus infection and this is common enough that there is a medical term for it and that is mouthful it is called maxillary sinusitis of endodontic origin so if you don't have a sinus infection after a root canal, chances are that it wasn't caused by a root canal at all. But it is a holdover from an infection that was present in your mouth, in your tooth. Now once the infection is removed, MCEO won't occur. That is the maxillary sinusitis of the endodontic origin. It won't occur. Now sinusitis like in symptoms after root canal could be a sinus communication too. Now there is another complication on the subject of a root canals and sinusitis. Now some patients may experience the symptoms of sinus infection after their root canal and think that these symptoms are caused by sinusitis. But the issue may be due to the communication, the sinus communication. This means a small opening in the sinus lining. The sinus lining is because it is very close to the roots of the teeth. Now when your dentist cleans out the damaged pulp during a root canal, it is possible for them to puncture the sinus lining. And um, this may lead to symptoms like sinus pressure and pain. The post nasal drip and other symptoms similar to the sinusitis. But the good news is that the sinus communication heals within a very few weeks in most cases and rarely requires any additional surgical intervention. So you need to take steps to prevent sinus infections due to infected teeth and ensure that your mouth, your tooth is restored, repaired and preserved for years to come. And if you need a root canal, do not wait. Thanks a lot.